guys so first i'm about to go in with my nyx eyebrow pencil and i'm just about to outline my brows Next, I'm about to go in with my LA Pro Girl Concealer in the color Toffee, and I'm just about to clean them up. I did fix the beginning of my other eyebrow because I kind of wanted it to fade, and it was giving me kind of a boxy look. So I just took the end of the eyebrow pencil and spoofed them out just a tad bit. So next, I'm going in with my Juvia's Place Concealer. I think it's in the color 13. Um, you guys heard me complain about this <laughs> concealer. So instead of throwing it in the trash, I've decided to use it for an eyeshadow primer. Now I'm about to go in with my Juvia's Place Nubian Coral Palette and I'm about to go in with that brown um, towards the end. And then I'll go in with my Sweet Like Palette and I'm about to go in with that kind of a red color and pack it on top of the brown. Fun fact, it took me like seven tries. <laughs> Um, to get the perfect eyeshadow look so that's why you see the other eye already completed I was about to give up I was like you know what I'm over it <laughs> now I'm about to go in with my warrior 2 um, palette from Juvia's place and I'm about to go in with a black Black is harsh and black is hard to work with. So you don't want to put too much on because then you will have to redo your eyeshadow look, okay? And I did bring my eyeshadow a little bit too high by the brows on this eye. And I didn't really notice until I started re-watching the videos. So don't pay that no mind, okay? And now I'm about to go back in with my Sweet Like palette and I'm about to go in with this neon pink color um in the crease that's what i'm packing on now and then i actually went in and uh did a metallic pink line because i thought that the eyeshadow was too boring okay and i'm going in with my fenty hydrovisor primer next i'm about to apply my juvia's place foundation stick in the color Cameroon. Now I'm about to go in with my e.l.f. Camo Concealer in the color Deep Olive and I'm about to highlight 
the normal areas, you know. Now I'm about to go in with another Juvia's Place foundation stick. I think this color is called Sakoda. Sakoda. I forgot, but I'll put it in the description down below. And I'm just about to contour my face. Now I'm about to go in with my Airsprung Extra Translucent Setting Powder. And I'm just about to set my highlight. Now I'm about to go in with my Black Radiance um, Complexion Palette and I'm just about to use my e.l.f. Contour Brush and contour my nose. I love, love, love the way I contour my nose, y'all. <laughs> yes. I'm using that same palette and I'm just about to contour my face. I forgot to record this part, but I did go in with my BH Cosmetics Duo Flower um, Blush just to add some color to my face. I'm going in and highlighting my nose, the bridge of my lip, and my cheeks. Next, I'm about to do my lips and I'm going in with my Absolute New York Coffee Bean Lip Pencil. And if you haven't already, go ahead and check out my lip combo video where I do lip looks, you know. And then the gloss I'm using is Juvia's Place in the color Petty Betty. I did my bottom lashes off of camera. All you do is take old lashes, pull them apart, take two clusters off and add them to the bottom of your lash. And I've already applied my lashes. Now I'm going in with my dewy finish setting spray and there you go.
keeping you girls fun one tutorial at a time. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys.